Stevie, a 2 1 victory here at Humbug Park against Crossgates Primrose. How are you feeling after that? Elated, to be honest, I thought the boys were fantastic from the minute, first minute to the last minute. Put in a lot of effort and a lot of confidence as well, and I think uh, it's the fourth defeat this season. Ago. You can see why we scrapped for everything. I think we, we mashed out scrap them today and uh, played them at the same time, so I'm really delighted with the boys. Both scored, but Dawson knew our season to do that. We played in a 4 4 2 type um, system. We always get some of them, so I'm really delighted with them. I'm really delighted with Dawson and the performance of the others. You mentioned it being scrappy, was that where we got down to nerves? Yeah, I think it would be realistic to talk about nerves, but we've tried our best to just cut the nerves of the boys, just to concentrate on the game as in hand and play the game as a thought of them. It's the same three points, whatever happens, and you know what? We'll be able to support them. Regardless of whether we win, lose, or draw, we'll be able to support them regardless. And uh, I think we've tried to calm the nerves, and I think you saw an assured performance, certainly second half, it was really assured. We made subs at the right time, we got on the right subs as well. Changing the left back for back to get more experience as a certain goal. Okay, not against us, but certainly it was going to be a, a bit better with trying to get, get an equaliser. Uh, and also, I think putting Matty on for Lundberg after an hour. I, mean, I didn't expect to get an hour at Lundberg, but we did, and he was great. Putting Matty on because a bit of extra injection energy. So that helped us big style as well. So I nervousness a little bit, I guess, but I think that's was natural. Um, but I think the boys are doing well to try and handle could as well after them with the disappointment to losing the equaliser just before half time to come out and get one early in the second half. The equaliser was a disappointment, the time it came, it definitely was. And that just shows you what they're capable of. They had three shots in the first half and the third one was the last one. And I, mean, I think maybe we could have defended a little bit better. Um, certainly the cross would be stopped, but maybe if I've got a better body position at the back post, we can see that goal. But at the end of the day, they've scored and we've re reacted really well. That's what's the thing, we've lost the first half. Keep doing what you're doing, keep being positive, use it with the pitch, use your quality, take care of yourself. And I think it showed that it looked like we could, we could score. I don't say women wanted to, but if we had to score, I think there was a goal in this. You mentioned Cammy Dawson as well, two goals for him today. I'm absolutely delighted for him. Honestly, he's sat on that bench all year. He's not given me any bother at all. He's just done his thing, keep me training, he's worked away, and he's had a lot of bad press for the punters. Rightly so sometimes, but I don't think the system we're playing is actually helping him. But now we've kind of adjusted a little bit, we've got more of two strikers and three, and the, and, the, and the emphasis is more on build up rather than playing off the mistakes. I think the Cammy's done a stunt at everyone, I think. Last week against people was great, his link up play was great, he's more of a play, his link up play, and his chance to be happy with that. And they're two massive goals for us. That's the best thing. You go through the team and go, what performance, what performance. So I'm really, really happy. On to Wednesday night now in Genefield away. Difficult game. They just keep coming thick and fast. Doesn't get any easier. Um, another team who, at the beginning of the season, were fancy to actually win this league. And I don't think it would be, it'd be wrong to say that they're a good side. They're a very, very good side who, on their day, can actually give you a real ball. I think we beat a five not home last time. So they'll be looking at a venge for that. However, they did have a man sent off and it did take Penko a long time to break them down. So I'm expecting a tough game on Wednesday, but they point in there just keep giving. They really just keep giving and I'm sure on Wednesday they'll give them more. So there it is. Thank you, Stevie. Well done.